Hello, myself Dr. Maitresh from Rims Rehab. Today I am going to explain you about uh, shin bone pain. So, let's see what is shin bone pain. So, basically shin bone pain is nothing but uh, pain in your lower leg. So, in the anterior with the case of here, here. So, this pain occurs uh, mainly in uh, athletes and uh, runners uh, and of a sports person. So, it occurs when, uh, so you know, there are in, uh, inflammation in the uh, muscles and the uh, tendons and ligaments uh, around around the shin bone, nothing but uh, the like a tibia, tibialis anterior. Uh, as in, so, so the treatment and the managing of management of this uh, 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 what condition we'll be seeing now. So let's see. So initially for the shin bone pain, we'll be applying. Uh, I, icing, uh, icing, continuous icing for and also compression bandage in severe swelling and all. So after after uh, reducing of swelling and pain, we will be further proceeding to these exercises and stretches. So during uh, during the pain, we should not uh, uh, stretch the muscle or do any sort of movement of around the shin bone. So mind you. So let's let's go on to stretches and exercises. Yeah. So let's move on to stretches. So we'll be training, we'll be lying this high in the half length position and uh, the foot should be moving to the outward and only for 5 to 10 seconds and back. Okay. So again, move to the outward slowly. And we'll be feeding the stretch here and uh, hold it for 5 to 10 seconds and it's slowly back. Okay, and if um, like um, yoga persons or um, persons who are with very flexible, so they can even catch the toes, they can even uh, catch the toes and move. So to feel the stretch more. So this is this is one type of stretch. So another level grade of upgrade of stretch. So we can call it. Yeah. So. And then maybe we can, or else we can, or else we'll be lying in the strong position, strong position, and we'll be aiming of foot in this position for this to uh, focus your angle foot so that the foot should be in the stretching position and you should be lifting your knees and you can see the stretch in your toes to the knee. Yeah, just hold it for five to ten seconds. And just two legs and leg eight. Just do it so eight times and next further proceeding to the exercises. So nothing but a facilitation of the muscle. B. So for this we're gonna need a roller, roller pillow or whatever. You can roll a line set or whatever you have. And so not an insurance. So when we will be uh, in a position of a uh, uh, cat and dog position in this leg, so we will be moving, uh, moving on leg, moving on leg and stretching it, and again back, okay, and also again, and back. This is to do for 10 to 15 repetitions, okay. And again back in this way slowly. The anterior side of your foot, like up, should be facilitated. Okay. And again, this is for the calf area of the in. So so. So we're placing our uh, this roller underneath our uh, high lower lower leg. Okay. So that means we're pushing inner and also outwards, okay? Inner words and not forward words. This facilitating our leg under this, okay? Inner word and also outwards, inner word and also outwards okay 
So this exercise should be performed for 10 to 15 repetitions of daily of two sets. So with this exercise, you can cure with the uh, shin bone pain. So, so for more these type of informatic videos, follow links for you. Thank you.